Casey here at Lobo Gymnastics. This is our third week of online video classes. We're focusing on cartwheel skills. So today we're just gonna go over a few more good cartwheel drills that you can practice at home to help perfect your cartwheel. So for this one, we're just gonna still work on keeping our arms up and focusing on having their arms by the ears. So that's why we are using the balloon. That just helps them squeeze their arms together and also keeping their arms up. So Coach Casey's just jumping from star to star with two feet, okay? So going to the next one, we're gonna go right into the next one. This one, we're going to be practicing our lunge position and switching our feet with our lunges, okay? So Coach Casey's gonna start here and she's just switching her lunge feet and we're just going down the black line. Still focusing on keeping our hands up, arms by our ears, squeezing tight, for those cartwheels. So this one again, we're still working, keeping our arms up by our ears. And this one we're doing straddle jumps since that is a very important position in our cartwheel skill. Big straddle jumps. You can go up and then you can even go back down um, as well to kind of just get some more practice in. Making sure they're opening and closing their legs together over each star. The first drill that we're gonna do for your little one is with a balloon. So this is just gonna help them and remind them to keep their hands up by their ears and to squeeze also. So once they do a couple reps of this, stand, starting in their lunge position, you do see Coach Casey, you can have them put the balloon down and then go ahead and have them reach down for their hands. Now, we did put and just trace the hands for them, and that's just so they can have a visual because it will be easier for them. So this one is gonna be, it's gonna be a little bit harder. So the first one we did was on a raise, a higher raised surface, and that was also to help them um, be able to come back up easier with their arms up. So now with this lower surface, it will be harder for them, and it'll challenge them a little bit more to get their hands up. So you'll see that we do have feet traced and hands on the mat. And those are just visuals for your little one to have. So you can go from both sides depending on what, uh, what hand and foot your little one puts in front. And we'll determine what side they go down to. So this one we used stars. And what we're doing is we're practicing that rainbow motion that your legs make when you're doing your cartwheel. Okay, so we're just kind of doing a bear walk and then we're starting with one foot and we're making our rainbow all the way over to each color star. So while practicing it, you can even say the colors of the stars just to help with color recognition for your little one. So we're doing about seven rainbow kicks with our stars. For this drill, you're going to be cartwheeling into the shape. So we have shapes that are on the floor and we're putting our hands on the outside of the hula hoop. So leave enough space in between your hula hoop and your shapes for you guys to actually do your lunge position. And you'll see Coach Casey is doing her cartwheels to each shape and even have them t say the names of the shapes when they're cartwheeling. So that's a square. Now Coach Casey's gonna cartwheel to the heart. This is just good practice for them to eventually start doing big cartwheels with their feet all the way up in the air.